KKM family travel expert, Julia Diamond, here with the inside scoop on the best things in Bermuda to do with kids. So I've partnered with Allianz Travel Insurance to bring you a six-part video series about family travel. And today, we're talking about the best places to take your kids when in Bermuda. Little geography lesson for everybody today. Uh, a lot of people think that Bermuda is in the Caribbean, but it's not. No, it's actually north in the Atlantic, just a little off the coast of North Carolina. Now, I just got back from a week-long adventure with my own two little ones, and Bermuda was amazing. I mean, we had such adventures, everything from pirate ships to swimming with dolphins. One of the island's top family-friendly attractions is the Bermuda Aquarium, Museum, and Zoo. Located in Flats Village, this small facility is three attractions in one. Now your kids will learn about Bermuda's underwater ecosystem. Plus, there are over 300 birds and reptiles and mammals from islands all around the world. Head to the Royal Naval Dockyard. It's the largest fortress on the island and there are a ton of family-friendly activities. So there's a 70-foot wooden structure that looks like a moray eel, and kids can crawl through it. I mean, it is a lot of fun. Then it comes the best part, all right? Dolphin Quest is also there. So kids can swim with and interact with bottlenose dolphins. It really was special. Um, you know, I know it's very controversial and not everyone will feel comfortable doing this experience, but from my point of view, the facility was top notch. The instructors really cared, were very educated, and really fostered a love for dolphins with my two little ones. Another one of my top favorite things to do with kids in Bermuda is Crystal and Fantasy Caves. I mean, this place is whimsical. You know, you walk underground, there's stalagmites, stalactites. It really transports the kids in an, into another world. And it was actually the inspiration for Jim Henson's Fraggle Rock, which is kind of fun too. So after you visit the caves, you've got to check out Bailey's Ice Cream Parlor. Take the kids, get some ice cream. They all have over 30 flavors, even some unusual ones, like a dark and stormy cocktail, but in an ice cream. Thank you, yes. Uh, be sure to bring your cash since they don't take credit cards. But it's a great spot and it's also walking distance from the cave. Restaurants with two little kids can be quite challenging, but I have found the best spot in the whole world and it's in Bermuda. It's called Village Pantry and this restaurant is designed for parents to have a lovely meal. All the food is um, locally sourced, beautiful, beautiful food. But beside, while you're eating, your kids are playing happily with toys. It's fantastic, what a concept. Um, so it's like a play space, it's a restaurant, delicious cocktails, delicious food. And the best part is, kids get to make their own pizzas. So in terms of places to stay, my favorite spot by far was the Fairmont in Southampton. So you are almost directly on the beach. The hotel really caters to kids. So there's a play space, an explorers club with all kinds of cool kids activities. Um, my favorite part might have been the resident ducks they have on their front lawn. So every morning my kids would go outside and feed the ducks. The best thing about the Fairmont Southampton is definitely the beach. Super shallow waters, perfect for little ones, and it, they also give you buckets and pails so kids can play on the sand. It's just another perfect day in Bermuda. Yeah, so. All right. Thank you. The Fairmont Hotel is also walking distance to Horseshoe Bay Beach. And this is this beautiful crescent-shaped beach that's popular with tourists and locals alike. At the western end of this beach is my favorite spot. It's called Baby Beach. And as soon as you see it, you'll know why. This is perfect for toddlers and little ones who are just learning how to swim. The waters are so shallow, it's secluded, it's protected from the waves, it's an ideal spot, and you feel like you have your own beach. Not everyone knows about it. It's a bit of a, a, a local secret. In all the beaches we experienced in Bermuda, Baby Beach was so amazing. There are actually no rental car companies in Bermuda, so when you're on the island, transportation is mostly through taxis and through ferries. Now, if you are taking a taxi and you're traveling with a baby, you might be thinking about car seats. There's a great local company called Little Long Tails, and they'll rent car seats, as well as cribs, and books, and toys, and pretty much anything you need for your kids um, for a very reasonable fare. That way you can keep your kids safe 
while you're driving around the island and entertained when you're back in the hotel room. And for more family travel tips, please visit my website, juliadiamond.com. 